this is how I play the game! Oh my god, excuse me. Oh, 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 oh my god. Oh, 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 excuse me. Devour. Devour. Trying to clear it out, and it's not working. <laughs> a stupid frog in my throat. Devour. Devour. I think I just got it, actually. Okay. That was delicious. Oh! Sound good? Now, I got a few things to discuss here today on the pre-stream. The first, folks, you may not be aware of this, but it's very important. In the United States of America, later tonight, it's actually at 2 a.m. on Sunday, the 5th. So that would be, if we're, if we're calculating as of right now, 13 hours from now, our daylight savings time ends, all right? It's hilarious because a lot of people are still debating why we still do it. And a lot of people are like, I don't even know. It doesn't serve any purpose anymore. Like, you know, years and years ago, daylight savings time. or sa It's actually daylight saving time, by the way, not savings. Daylight saving time um, had a purpose. And it doesn't anymore. Like, it really doesn't serve anything for anybody at all. Um, <clears throat> and it seems like uh, it's just a waste of time. Like, it's so stupid because, you know, every certain amount of months, we have to remember to change our clocks. I'm not a whiny baby. And it throws everybody off because all business changes. All the times of all the businesses around here change. The banks, you know, everything in, in America, in the United States changes by this hour. So, honestly, you know, I have to change my time too. Um, because if I don't, then I won't even be aligned with all the businesses and everything around here. So my streams will change by one hour starting tomorrow. And what does that mean? It's fall back, meaning we gain an hour. So it's so stupid. At 2 a.m., our clocks will roll back to 1 a.m. <clears throat> I know that sounds really stupid, because it is, but that's what it is. Uh, we gain an hour. So, that means tomorrow, yes, I'll be streaming at the same times, but not really. It'll actually be an actual hour later in the day that I will be streaming. So, yeah, it'll be... <laughs> so, FYI, just so you guys are aware, tomorrow I will be here for the stream. You know, it'll be, you know, business as usual. For zombies, but keep in mind that it's daylight saving time, and therefore it will be an hour later than usual. <clears throat> okay. Apparently in the in the European Union, over in Europe, it already happened. You guys already did it. Uh, that's what I mean, too, why it's so stupid. It's so confusing, because different places in the world do it at different times. And so... <laughs> so it's like, uh, what time is it? Completely brain dead. Nothing between here and here. <laughs> you know, for, for someone across the world, what time is it? I don't know. The times are all screwed up. Time's all screwed up everywhere, man. Um, a lot of countries are getting are getting rid of it. Because they're like, what is the point of this stupid thing? It doesn't matter anymore. It's so pointless. So, I guess we'll see. Um, we'll see how it goes with this. But hopefully people will be here on time tomorrow. That's the other thing I gotta make sure with... The people who I'm co-oping with tomorrow, that they're aware of the daylight saving time change, so that I don't go to do zombies tomorrow and there's nobody around. <laughs> I, as of last night, <clears throat> hit the record for the most number of subscriptions I've ever had uh, on the stream at once. And actually, right now, I want to say shout out to Hobbs1017 who just subbed to the channel. Sometimes I seriously think that people are incredibly fucking stupid. I don't understand what they were thinking. Um... Thank you very much for that, Hobbs. What I'm doing right now is refreshing. I want to see how many subs I have because uh, I may have now topped that. Let's see. Hold on. Yes, as of right now, I have 292 subscribers to my channel. That's the most I've ever had. So thank you very much to everyone who has subscribed to the channel. Thanks for the money, dummies. Because that's exactly what you fucking are. A bunch of fucking empty-headed idiots who paid me money to get absolutely nothing out of it. Thanks. <laughs> wow. Some people are just fucking idiots. What else can I say? You gotta be an idiot.
Uh, I appreciate that. And now, uh, we're actually very, very close to hitting the 300 sub point threshold. If you're not aware, ladies and gentlemen, if I hit the 300 subscriber point threshold, um, what that means is that it's going to unlock more emotes for the channel. I believe it's two more. So we'll be able to add two more emotes for subscribers uh, if I do get this, which would be awesome, right? I like having more stuff for my subbers. Uh, or subbers. Oh, my God. Subscribers. I'm not going to start calling you guys subbers. <laughs> I should say subs for my subs, not my subbers. Subbers sounds like you're talking to, like, a five-year-old. Hey, little subbers. I'm a mature adult. The thing is, though, that I'm worried about, folks, is the way the subscriptions work on Twitch is that they're literally live per the time that you sub. So to give you an example, right now it's 1.20 p.m. If someone last month subscribed at 1.22 p.m. a month ago and they don't automatically resub because maybe let's say they did a Twitch Prime subscription or whatever, they will automatically be decreased from my sub count at 1.22 p.m. And I see this all the time during the streams. I'll be playing and I'll say, oh, I got five new subs today. And then I go look at the subtotal and the subtotal overall went down for the day. And I'm like, huh? And that's what it is, is... Uh, you know, it's a net for the whole day, so... If a few more people subscribe today, you know, soon, give them their money, give their money. You know how rude it is to ask people about money? You should not ask about fucking money. And it fills a beggar. I need th that money, I really do, I need that money. Anything for this, right? That means that we'll hit the 300 point cap and I'll be able to add more emotes, which would be awesome. Um, but, I don't know, there's no guarantee that we're actually gonna hit that, okay? Um, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Uh, excuse me. Shout out to Game Master 2003 is dead who did a 10 bit cheer. He says, Hello, Phil. You should do a patron's choice with poorly cooking it with the king when fans vote on what you should cook. Well, it's like I said, someone suggested this the other day as well, but you probably were not here. Um, yeah, uh, I really, the reason I ended poorly cooking with the king is because I don't have anything else to do. Like, I, I, I cooked to the extent of my cooking abilities. I don't have a good, I, I'm not a good cook, folks. I'm not. All right. I don't have a lot of versatility when it comes to cooking in the kitchen. Basically, there's a few things I can do. I can bake something if it's really easy to bake, and I can fry something in a pan. And, you know, I can maybe make a couple sandwiches and stuff like that, paninis, uh, you know, breakfast stuff like eggs. That's about it. I can't do much of anything else besides my homemade sauce, which is because my mom taught me, and I've now been perfecting that recipe for three and a half years, so I'm pretty good at making a pot of Italian sauce. But outside of that, um... No, I don't really have much cooking ability, all right? I'm terrible at chopping vegetables. Um, you know, I don't really have any kind of baking or culinary or anything like that. Nothing. No kind of expertise. So, people are like, oh, well, we'll just do a random recipe. Like, so, what you want me to do is take time away from working, where, you know, this is how I pay my bills, to one day somehow figure out how to live stream out of my kitchen, which I also don't know how I would do. I guess I'd have to mess with my phone. And find a way to mount my phone on a tripod or something in order to film this. <clears throat> Keep in mind, the video quality on a phone isn't great either. Um, just throwing that out there because a lot of people are like, Oh, just in real life streaming. You do realize that like video streaming on a phone is not good. <laughs> it's not. It's pretty shitty. Um, I'm just saying. But uh, And so then you want me to not only figure all that out, then you want me to do a random recipe I've never done before. So obviously it's probably going to come out wrong. Um, and stream live from my kitchen. The other thing is... You know, yes, maybe the prep work would be interesting. Absolutely. You know, okay, I'm chopping the ingredients, I'm putting them together or whatever to make this meal. But what about the cooking time? What do you want me to do? Sit around with my thumb up my ass? I just, I realistically don't see how this could be an entertaining idea. I don't. Um. I just don't. Um. I, 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 I honestly, I, I think what would happen, if I set this up as a patron goal, here's what I think, exactly what I think would happen. It, we would probably hit the goal, because it's something so different, I think people would come out to pledge to hit it. People would vote and everything on these things and what they want to see me cook. Finally, something would be chosen that's probably so fucking elaborate and crazy that it would be so overcomplicated, there's no way I'm going to do it right. Okay? It could cost me a bunch of money to get all the ingredients. Good. And now I'm going to try to do it. The stream quality is going to be shit. It's probably going to be, like, terrible, choppy, and everyone's going to complain that they paid to see this and now it's shitty quality. And overall, the stream probably won't be very good. All right? Being honest here. Um, and then people are going to complain that it's not good. You know, there's sometimes when I think that there's good ideas, and sometimes I think I, that they're bad ideas. I don't think this would be a great idea. I'm just saying. Um, you know. But, you know, maybe maybe I'm wrong. There's a lot of times that I'm wrong, too. I mean, I'm not afraid to admit when, when I'm completely wrong, and maybe I am wrong here. Maybe I'm off base. Maybe this would be a good, a good idea for a goal for, like, maybe January. Maybe January's patron goal. Do, you know, this in-real-life stream that I figure out how to do it with my phone. And, uh, <clears throat> I do some kind of cooking. I don't know. What do you guys think? Yeah, exactly. Crystal Chemist. He just said, GSP tries it. Beef Wellington. Exactly. 
That's what it would end up being. It would be like something so hard that even on like cooking shows, people fuck up and can't do it right. That's what people would ask me to cook. I'd be like, how the fuck am I supposed to do this? <laughs> all right. Well, anyway, all right. I'll, I'll take it into consideration. So then maybe, maybe in January, we'll do this as the goal or something. I don't know. <clears throat> Shout out to Slash, who just did a 15-bit cheer. Are you a functional retard? I have to ask. And shout out to Darth Radovan Viking. This guy fucking sucks my dick. I prefer a penne. Oh! Easy to eat. Oh! Phil's a faggot. Phil's fat. Phil's a loser. Phil's a beggar. I have a micro penis. <laughs> Alright, I'm not dead, but I swear to God, I wish I fucking was.